What's up everybody? So today I just wanna hop on here and share something with y'all, okay? So look, if you look on my screen, you're gonna see it's an article that was published on the 17th by Fox News and it says the Chinese Communist Party is rewriting the Bible. We scroll down, it says as a part, um, as part of a push to synthesize religion, the Chinese Communist Party has embarked on a 10 year project to rewrite the Bible and other religious texts, all right? If we scroll down a little bit further, it says across Henan Providence, local CCP officials for forced Protestant churches to replace the Ten Commandments with Jing Jing Pen's quote, thou shall have no other gods before me, okay? So look, this is right here in your face. But to go further, let's read in the Bible to the book of Amos, Amos 8.11. Amos 8.11 says, Behold, the days come, said the Lord, that I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread, nor a famine of thirst of water, but of hearing the words of the Lord. So the Bible is saying that it's going to be a famine that's going to come on the land where people are no longer going to be able to hear the words of the Lord. And we know the Bible is the word of God. Let's go a little further. Revelation 22, 18 through, 18, uh, through 19, it says, for I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. If any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. And if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life and out of the holy city and out of the things which are written in this book. That's in the Bible. That's the last book of the Bible. And this is God saying, if you add to the Bible, God is going to add to the plagues. And if you take away from the Bible, God is going to take away your name from the book of life. So look, my question is this, if God is not real, if God is like this sky data that y'all like to say, why are they trying to rewrite the Bible? Treat it like it's Santa Claus, you know? Ain't nobody tripping about Santa Claus. We know that ain't real. Why are you trying to do that to the Bible? Man, look, Jesus is about to come back. Get your life right with Christ before it's too late. Get you a hard copy of the Bible too, man. And also, like the average person, when they read their Bible, they usually use the audio Bible, okay? So if they make this a rule or a regulation because they say that the Bible is, hurt speech, uh, is hate speech and all of this stuff, all they have to do is press one button and they can get rid of the apps of the Bible. You always want a physical copy of the Bible and you want to memorize it and get it down in your heart because they can take away the Bible. But if you have it in your heart, they cannot take that away from you. The Bible says that that you're supposed to have the word of God written on your hearts. They, if you write it on your hearts, then, bro, it's going to be with you everywhere you go. As always, I love y'all. God bless.